We had a great November and December focused on track install. Vacoma Northwest Coasters arrived in mid-November. Track went up really fast. Weather was really helpful there. They've got all of the ride installed, all the cue gates, control panels. Anything you need to operate the ride, it has been installed. I was happy with how the, the ride went together. I think there's some interesting elements that aren't really shown truly in the videos. We're gonna surprise some people when they show up. I was certainly surprised to see it all go in. Outside of ride install, our midways are getting real close to being completely finished. Our fencing contractors on site made some good progress on all of the perimeter fencing. There's a lot on this ride because the ride's so close to the ground. Seeing that go around that whole area is really putting one of the finishing touches. It's crazy, it's January and we're talking about finishing touches, but we're getting real close on that side of the project. We also installed the cranberry can top, got a sneak peek of the, the interior light of that, the red light. Probably one of my most exciting things to date is seeing that light come on. I think it's gonna add a nice experience to riders that are riding at night. Inside the building, working through some finishing touches on the ride side of the station, but overall we're in really good shape. Moving over to the condition space, the addition, which is less than 500 square feet, was added on. It's weathered in, they're actually putting the windows in today. We're gonna see drywall start going up and that'll be worked on over the next several weeks as weather is not so great. We are well on our way to being ready for dry testing, which is slated to begin end of February, 1st of March. Vacoma will be back on site for commissioning and testing, and that should be wrapped up end of March, well in advance of opening day. Mm -hmm.